video. I'm going to be doing a hand treatment. As some of you might know, I do have some skin conditions. So I've been trying to help them out lately because it is winter. Uh, they've gotten worse. So I'm trying to make them, my skin, less painful and um, just condition it a little bit better. I have this camera that shows me and I also have a camera set up here which is focused on my hands. So if you see me looking up, that's just to check that camera. So. I have this, which is actually a bath treatment, it's like a oatmeal bath, I don't know if you've heard of this, it's really good for your skin, it really helps my skin, so I'm just using this um, as a hand treatment, basically I have warm water here. And uh, I'm going to be using it on my hands. So. Because it's a full bath treatment, I don't use the whole package because it's just a bowl of water, not an entire bathtub, obviously. probably looks really weird, but, okay, so that's about half the package, and you need to mix it, so my hands are going to be going in here already, there's going to be clumps, and you can just kind of squeeze them in your fingers and it dissolves. Basically, I'm gonna submerge one hand at a time and with the other hand kind of massaging in the oatmeal. Some days I come home from work and my hands are in very serious pain because I've been working all day and I don't have time to stop and put motion on or I'm working with my hands so they get very sore and cracked so and when you do that, when you have that happen, when you go to put lotion on, it can sting really bad. But I found that this is a nice soothing way to calm your skin down, um, relax it a little bit. And then usually after I do this, I put some lotion or some sort of something on it. And it doesn't burn that way because you've already got the oatmeal soaked into your skin.
if you circle the bottom of the bowl, you might feel a few more clumps of the package. And you're just gonna mix it up. And it's a good way to give your finger something to do while they're soaking. be a little odd um, angles when you're trying to like submerge your whole hand. You kind of have to stretch your back a little bit because of it. I'm sure they have like a bowl or something that would work better like at a salon or something like where it has like an indent to rest your arm. I basically let my hand soak until the water goes cold. Because it is cold outside, so I don't really want to soak my hands in cold water, but just power along. You may notice that I'm submerging this hand a little bit more than this one, and it's because this hand's worse. <laughs> so, this hand isn't in as much pain as this one is. So, this one needs it a little bit more than this one does.
really cracked really bad at work, okay? And it did not feel good, so I'm really trying to prevent that from happening again. See, you might have a little bit of texture from the oatmeal on your hands. That's fine. Just rub it in. this in one last time. Alright. Get the towel set here off to the side of the bowl. And I'm just gonna set my hands here and let them air dry a little bit. And I can blot it if I need to. Already, my hands feel much smoother because of it, and there, my skin is more relaxed. It's not as tender, and now that that's soaked in, when I go to put lotion on, it won't sting because of. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, hopefully it relaxed you. Maybe um, if your hands have been <laughs> bugging you lately, you can try something like this and maybe it will soothe you a little bit. I know it, it takes away my pain, so maybe it can help one of you. I hope you guys have a good night. And I'll see you in the next video.